Hey guys, it's Mary Vazel. Welcome back. In today's video, I will tell you guys things that nobody tells you about being a YouTuber. I'm so, so excited to actually tell you guys the reality and the struggles of being a YouTuber. The things that I've been through as a YouTuber. Make sure to subscribe and follow me on Instagram. I am Vazel for my updates on all the random things on Instagram. You know what I mean? Let's go straight into the video. The first thing is it doesn't just happen. If you create a YouTube channel, uh, you did your first ever YouTube videos and then it doesn't just make you a most successful YouTuber like, like this year. YouTube needs a lot of effort and hard work into your videos and then a lot of patience literally. So be patient if you want to be a YouTuber and yeah, that's the most important thing ever, patience. The next one is coming out with video ideas. This is the hardest part ever to be a YouTuber, like figuring out and thinking what video should I post and popular videos that people actually haven't done. When it comes to my YouTube channel, I'm a bit perfectionist. I need my videos to be authentic and very original and creative also. And sometimes it takes a lot of time to actually like figure out. It takes like one day actually to figure out what video should I post. Think what topic should I talk about on my video. YouTube takes a lot of time. So the next one is time consuming. Other than YouTube, I still have my life. I have to actually go to school, I have my family, I have my friends. Then I have to actually plan videos. Planning beauty videos takes a lot of my time. I really have to have the free time to actually really like think for the perfect video to post on YouTube. And in the part of being a YouTuber, filming. If you use the artificial lights, um, like me, I'm using the ring lights one and the natural lights. It's better to use natural lights actually. But if you use artificial lights, it's very hard because you just have to actually carry them everywhere and then you have to actually set up the tripod, the camera setting, the camera angle and it's very hard, it takes a lot of time. Setting up everything for me actually it takes like around one hour I guess. When it comes to filming, I actually started filming at 9 and right now it's uh, 12 54 p.m. I know it's very long for me to actually film this whole entire video but yeah filming takes a lot of time so if you want to create a YouTube channel it's better for you to actually like create a schedule or something and make sure that you have a free time in your life basically YouTube it, it needs a lot of time to film edit yeah oh and edit for me I'm a kind of like a fast editor I think because I'm already like suitable editing since I'm a fast editor, if I actually edit like short videos, short vlogs, it takes only one day for me to edit the whole entire vlogs. And if it's a long as videos or vlogs, it took me like uh, almost two days to finish the process of the editing. Editing needs a lot of patience and I love editing so 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 much because it's just so fun. Certain situation, how I edit my footage in Langla, my computer shut down the tibula and it's really annoying but sometimes when the editing is so so fun for me and I literally can edit it all night all day because it's very relaxing. For me, I love to actually um, edit then film. Because film is very tired. We have to like set up everything and then anything we just edit and just it's very chill so that's why I love editing so much than filming oh by the way should I do like a how I edit my videos and how I film my YouTube videos should I do that if I should comment below and I really cannot talk right now I'm just too tired of talking I literally tried to film this video because it's too long look I have like a script for this whole entire video so the next thing is school life. My life before I started YouTube and after is so different for me. My school life before people actually find out about my channel was super different. It was like literally so boring and like a normal student life. But after people found out found out about my YouTube channel, it was so crazy. My classmates started to find out and they started to call me names and it's like they started to scream in front of the class, in front of the teacher. Oh my god, Irene is so famous. Irene is so famous on YouTube. Irene is a YouTuber. Oh my god, we have a YouTuber in our class. Like that's so amazing. So that is very like embarrassing but I just want to thank them for watching my videos. <laughs> um, I got treated very bad at school for doing YouTube videos some of my friends were so nice and supportive about my channel but some of them was like so mean 
they start to call me names and then they start to make fun jokes about my YouTube channel they made jokes in front of me which I just I, I pretend that I didn't care about it or I didn't hear that they were like literally made fun of it at first when they found out that I have a YouTube channel I was shook and then I was so scared but right now I'm just like whatever you say what you want I don't care as long as I am happy with my YouTube channel then I am fine just prepare people to find out about your YouTube channel don't be impressed keep on doing what you love if you love doing YouTube so just keep doing it don't let anybody stop you from chasing your dreams because that's stupid you know keep doing what you love and chase your dreams my school friends some of it like treated me like a famous person and they asked me what is it like to be a youtuber some of it treated me like a stupid person who does a youtube channel it's pretty mean but for me i just don't really care anymore i'm a chamalas like a son at all just don't care about what people like think about your youtube channel so just do what you love oh my god my butt's suffering I don't know why people, people make such a big deal because I watch other YouTubers uh, videos that they get bullied when they make YouTube videos and they are YouTuber kena bully by gila kat sekolah and I don't know why people make such a big deal of it it's just like we are just like you guys but we just create videos on YouTube we are still humans I am still like you guys I drink, I sleep, I tengok TV I, I go out, I go shopping I, I'm just like you guys but I'm just so so grateful some of my friends who actually support me support my YouTube journey they're so so sweet next one is passions slash paycheck some of the people out there who actually create a YouTube channel and make YouTube videos just for the popularity or money which is super duper duper wrong if you love doing it and you can keep doing it soon it will become a paycheck and very successful but if you're doing it just for the money and the popularity I'm sorry to say this but you are not going anywhere it's not going to be successful or anything it is yeah do it because you love it and it's for the passion then next one is stress pressure and anxiety being a youtuber has so much pressure because like you have to basically be perfect all the time to be the personality that people want being stressed about what video should i do and pressure for posting three times a week overthinking if it's a good video or not having those anxiety where i feel like someone's going to kidnap me and a weird anxiety i'm literally reading the script right now the next thing is subscribers this is about you guys i never actually meet you guys in real life well only two which is at school but hey it feels so nice to meet school fans i never meet you guys in real life but i hope one day i can meet you guys in real life sometimes i'm jealous youtubers out there who can actually meet their fans it's like the best feeling ever when you know someone someone is watching you or someone is a big fan of you it's the best feeling ever i'm hoping to actually meet you guys in public like you know give y'all a big hug and say you're amazing thank you so so much so if you guys actually like see me in public anywhere say hi to me or approach me and we can take good pictures you know what i mean and make good memories yeah just don't be shy at all because i'm so happy if i actually meet you guys anywhere in real life the next thing is balancing youtubers need to balance your life because of school family and friends and youtube it can be so stressful when you want to go out with your friends but you have to edit or film sometimes i just tell my friends that i cannot go out today because i have to film or edit videos sometimes they're just like oh my god why why do you have to like go to youtube first instead of friendship you know i i know friendship is very important but i go to youtube first because youtube is pretty important for me on school week I have a lot of school homework to do and I don't have the time to edit for like right now which is school holidays I have a lot of free time so it's not that bad but when school starts oh my god guys I usually Monday to Friday I'll do school and Friday night I'll start my YouTube live back and on Sunday night I'll start getting ready for school I don't know if this is a good video or not but hopefully it's a good video because I've been filming all day since 9 a.m. it's literally I know my back hurts so bad I really want to puke I'm so hungry <laughs> the things that you don't see when I'm filming I just tahan lapa when I'm filming thank you so so much for watching this whole entire video I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you guys uh, this Friday bye Mwah.